What's up, YouTube family? It's your girl Emma, and I'm back this morning with another semi vlog. Mm -hmm. Semi vlog. So today, y'all gotta go to the eye doctor today. Um, since my last checkup. So let's hope everything is good, which I don't think that it is. I think that my glasses needs to be the volume of the glasses need to be toned down some because I'm still having a problem with looking through my glasses at night, not during the day. So check it out. So I'm real basic today. Well, I'm basic every day, but uh, I'm going to wear these shoes today. Even though this is supposed to be fall, but it doesn't quite feel like fall, so I'm, I'm going to support my sandals today. I don't feel like, this is what I feel like looking like today, okay? Alright. So let's get ready to go. And then we're going to come back home. I got clothes I need to uh, fold today. Today probably just going to be um, an in-house vlog today, y'all. Because I got stuff I need to do around the house today, so I'm just going to clean up and fold the clothes today. Do stuff like that today. Okay? So, I switched out purses the other day. I was sporting this little bag. But since I have on um, burgundy, burgundy red or whatever the color you want to call it, I'm going to switch out. These are the ones that I wear the most because they got the bifocals at the bottom. So he told me to get, since I got two pair, and these are the ones with the, I don't wear these because, I don't know, I just can't see at night. I can see during the day. Yeah, I don't even wear my glasses during the day. So we're going to do that. Let's go. so tired of my eyes being jacked up I hate I even had this surgery I really do I, I mean it helped because I don't need my glasses the only time I need my glasses is at night that's the only time before the surgery I had the worm all the time to see to watch TV I had the worm I couldn't see the TV clear so I guess it, I guess it kind of, oh y'all, look at my neighbor's house, isn't that pretty? I hope she don't mind me showing the house without showing the address. She got it all decorated for uh, Halloween. Looks really nice. Alright, It's been cool, cool out here now, but it's going to warm up a bit. It's going to warm up. Leaves on, but it's, it's gonna warm up in the 70s. How y'all doing this morning, everybody? Doing good. How y'all feeling today? I don't remember taking my uh, I don't remember taking my uh, driver's license out. I 
have fun. All right, Jack, come on, let's go. Let's go. I'm going to tell her the, the sun is still real bright for my eyes. Like, I still have to wear my sunglasses. I mean, I can tolerate it. Just sometimes it's just too bright. I guess until my eyes adjust to it, and then I can uh, take my sunglasses off. Like now, it's early in the morning, and the sun is bright. Looks pretty, but I have to squinch it like I'm doing now if I don't have my sunglasses on until my eyes adjust to the brightness. Still, you know? y'all, it's only been three months for me. You have to remember, I have both eyes here. So, anyway, what's going on out here? The good doctor's gonna say, I know they're better, but we just gotta get this prescription right. Is this in the street? Oh, have mercy. Let me put my glasses on, y'all, because this sun is really bright. Really bright. I could have put on my black sweater. I'm tired. I told y'all when I'm tired, I don't think too quick. Yeah, I could have put on my long black sweater. I'm here in the house. Don't matter. People want to go to your free yard child. And we don't want to invade nobody's privacy. Okay. Oh, good. Ain't nobody in here. So we don't want to invade nobody's privacy.
Ooh, this bubble. Wait, what the hell? What is that? Yeah, if you have an insurance, so federal law says that we can't see you if you have no contract Just what I thought it was when I went to the doctor to get the second opinion and he told me that that's exactly what he told me so finally y'all I know what the problem is and it's not just me I know I wasn't going crazy I'm so excited I'm so happy now y'all oh my god look at this oh my god Look at that. Did y'all see that? The thing is on my car. What is that? Oh my God, look at this thing. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my goodness gracious. Thank God it's on the outside. It's not on the inside. Look at this thing. Yikes. What is it? Is it a cricket? I don't know what that is. Oh my God, let me get, let me go. Let me go. I feel like I'm being attacked with the, uh, what you call them things? When I went to the, uh, oh yeah. Ooh, I hate the, I hate the, 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 the put the wind wipers on. Oh my God, what should I do? What should I do? Oh my God. Oh, what should I do? Oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm gonna put the wind wipers on. Okay, so this is the deal. I have a skin tear in both eyes. I knew that's what that man told me when I went to get the second opinion. He told me, he said, it looks like you might have a skin tear from the surgery. I don't know what they call it, but I know it's like a, a surgical tear thing that causes the blurriness, or the, not the, well, not the blur, it's like, it's like a mist haze, like you got a film over your eye. I knew that's what it was. The other guy told me that. So anyway, so I'm going to come back. Um, I have a new prescription, but <coughs> but she told me to hold off on getting it did. Let's wait till I have this corrected and then see how my eyes look at night. Because it's only at night when the vision is worse. And that's because I have the film over my eye. That's what it is. I, I knew, I knew, I knew I could not be looking like this for the rest of my life so i'm excited about that y'all other than that my eyes are fine and i asked her about like the not circles was like the kind of like look like i'm tired or the darkness underneath my eyes. she said that that's just come from the surgery and me just worrying and stressing a bit so she said don't worry about that that's fine that'll, that'll take care of itself which i do believe it's just been really stressful driving at night and can't see clear enough to drive and then eliminate a lot of my activities 
like going to the movies and going out to dinner and just hanging out with friends and families and stuff like that trying to get back home before it gets dark because I can't see clear enough I can see but not clear enough but anyway y'all I'm so excited thank God somebody finally listened and knew exactly what I was talking about and she knew exactly what I was talking about so it's just this, this, this thing with the women you know we we see stuff together we understand each other we read each other so I'm very excited y'all so um, they're gonna call me for my next appointment before I can come in you can do this correction in the doctor's office you don't have to go out you know beat under the knife and all the stuff not something like that just something they can just do within the office a laser or whatever it is that they're gonna do I'm sure they're explaining it to me when I get it did so I'm just happy y'all so that's the deal on that so this car is awfully close to me awfully close to me Now what if there's no cars was right here and I couldn't bust a U like here on this parking lot? Well then, then I have to go in there and say, give him a license plate to number and say, hey, come move your car. You too close to me, I can't get up. See, I'm an excellent driver right here. Yeah, y'all, we got it taken care of. I'm so happy. I wish you could do it today, but no, I know they can do it today. Now I gotta come back. I'm going to correct that and y'all oh I can't wait y'all my vision is going to be perfect perfect like I told her like I don't need my glasses on to see the TV because I used to have to have my glasses on to see TV it's clear but it's going to be even clearer oh yeah I'm just so excited I'm so happy so that's the dealio when it comes down to my eyes so I'm going to wait because at first I told you, I thought maybe it was Sam's, the way the Sam were doing their prescription. Because I'm used to seeing clear with my glasses on. I'm not seeing like that at night time with these glasses. So anyway, y'all, we got that taken care of. God is good. God is good. God is great. That's all I can say, honey. God is good, God. was in a mess. We got to do some cleaning up. It's not like my house is dirty, dirty. 
and then like, hey, yeah, I just got stuff to work. Doing stuff. Y'all, my linen climate is, is in a mess. I need to make a vlog on that. Don't laugh. It's a mess. A hot mess. This is terrible. This is absolutely terrible. I need to clean all of this out. Bad. Get 
this morning. I'm gonna do my floors. I took my rugs up. I need to go downstairs and take them out because I'm gonna sweep them out my floors. Just a lot to do, y'all. A lot to do, honey. That's why I like taking my rugs to, to the laundry mat. Cause when you wash your rugs and stuff in your machine, I don't know if y'all can see all that. But it leaves the, the stuff from the rugs so and now I'm gonna have to send this through a cycle to try to get rid of all of this stuff from the rugs. Before I can wash my clothes in here. Let's go ahead. That's what I need to do. Just gonna send this through. See all that? I'm gonna come down here and sweep all that up. All right, y'all. There's the broom. But we're gonna wait till the cycle get through. And if it's still some more stuff in there, then I'll come down and sweep it up. This is where I fixed my breakfast this morning.
Okay, y'all, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish cleaning up. I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Thank you guys for hanging out with us today. I truly appreciate it. Don't forget to hit the like button, y'all, okay? Okay, so I'll pick you, I'll pick you guys up tomorrow. I'll see everybody tomorrow, right? Thanks for hanging out with me, y'all. I truly, truly appreciate it. Smooches to everybody. All right, y'all, let me finish cleaning up. Okay.